In this video, we are going to learn how to solve problems involving log of any page using the Casio Scientific Calculator, especially on Casio FPS 50 graphical calculator. Now that we're going through this video, I guarantee you that you will be able to solve problems involving log of any base using the Casio Scientific Calculator on Casio FPS 50 graphical calculator seconds for multiple choice question. So ensure you stay with me to the very end of this video because we are going to learn a lot guys okay if you look closely here you will see that we have six questions to practice with this video is loaded guys we are going to solve problems involving logarithmic equations as well okay having known that let's get a casio calculator and go into the details of this video okay this is casio fps cg50 graphical calculator now the very first thing you have to do will be to reset the calculator the sense of resetting it is to wipe out whatever previous value might have stored in the calculator. Okay, so quickly reset it. All you have to do is navigate to system using this navigation button. Okay, when you get a press is a code is a code for this calculator stand for your body. Alright, when you get a press F5, which is reset, then press F6 for the next page. When you get a press F to initialize all, then F1 and it will begin to initialize all as indicated here. Okay. It's not press is it okay let's begin with question one it says solve the following log 91 minus log 13 over log 245 minus log 5 now when the equation the log is not having a specified base just know that the base of that log is automatically based 10 all right so for this question one press is equal to now this one matrix we're going to make use of this log function all right so it's in fraction make use of this fraction button first so we have log 91 okay minus log 13. very very simple guys over we have log 245 okay minus log 5 and that's our friends recruits 0.5 now to get the anti-log of this problem all you have to do is to delete all then press shift this log button that we're going to press to find the anti-log all right so anti-log of what we got it to be 0.5 press is recruit so this is anti-log all right now let's solve question two delete everything here now this question two, the log, the base is specified, base five. Now, look at the log function I'm going to make use of. All right, so let's, the question is a fraction. Let's make, impute the fraction function. Then, press F4 for math. Look at the log function I'm going to make use of F2. All right, so let's impute the base here. We have base five, that's log 81. Okay, it's as simple as that, guys. Now, plus we have log okay the base is still five okay three all right the denominator we have log the base five okay here we have it to be two four three okay we have minus log the base is still five and here we have what three okay, nine sorry so that's all. First is a good now to get your result or answer. 1.666. All right. To get the anti log, all you have to do delete everything here. Press it. Delete all. Okay. Then press shift this log button. Anti log of 1. Point. Let's stop at 36. Okay. Press the good. So this will be the anti log. It's as simple as that, guys. Now. Let's go into solving this log rhythmic equations with this Casio scientific calculator. Okay, so this is everything here. Now, to solve log rhythmic equations with this calculator, you are going to make use of equation solver. And to do that, press menu first. Then, go to equation. So, I'm going to get a press recruit. Now, we're going to press f3 for the equation solver f3 okay so let's begin with question 3 we have log base 4 x equals 5 over 2 okay so when you get here 
you are going to press option then tap look at the function so you have it to be press f4 for it so the base is what base 4 all right to go here and put the x upper x now report to be like for press shift and this button all right action we have five over two and that's all now press is a quit okay now when you get here you are required to assign your x a value now i recommend so because i have parted with zero for a very long time and i have not found any error with this in a situation when zero refers to give the answer you can make use of one but for this video we are going to work with zero right like zero works often times okay so assign s to be zero that's what pays the goods pays the goods again so the answer is we display 32 that's the answer for this question so now let's stop with c on four okay delete everything here press exit exit delete f1 okay so go back to option back f4 so the base now question four is the base is x upper x okay and here we have it to be 27 okay it was shift this button a fraction 3 over 2 and that's all press is a good assign x to be 0 Okay, it's solving it. So the answer is what nine. So as simple as that, guys. Now let's solve question five. That looks a bit different, but very simple with this calculator. We are going to solve it now, and you see the answer. It's very simple. So delete everything. Press exit. Press exit. Press exit. Delete. Okay. So question five. If you log this, minus log this plus so one. Find x. Okay. So go back to option. Tab. F four. So we have the base now is base 10. Okay. In the bracket, we have it to be 2x upper x plus 1. Okay. Then we have minus option back F4. The base is base 10. Okay. Then in bracket, we have 3x upper x minus two all right then we have equal to shift this one and that's what press the quit assign x to be zero press is a quit is a quit again so the answer is what 0 0.75 it's as simple as that guys now lastly let's talk question six before we call it a class let's delete everything press is it is it delete f1 okay so let me screw up okay so go back to option back this log button so if i let this log the page is what x alpha x okay three plus log option back this the base is still what x okay and here we have it to be 27 we pause what four that's what press is a good assign s to be zero is a good is a good again i begin to solve it so the answer is what three it's as simple as that guys so this is basically how you can solve problems involving log of any base using the Cassie fs cg50 graphical scientific calculator and seconds for most choice questions probably there's something interesting for this video if you are new to the channel be sure you hit the subscribe button now to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this and the like share comment on this video let me how you feel from what i learned from this class if you seem to have any specific questions ask feel free to leave your question at the comment section below and i will ensure to give you a response that is for this slide guys thanks for watching don't forget to reset the calculator once you are done all you have to do is to press menu then go to system under press the goods 
F5, reset, F6, next page, F2, F1, and it begins to reset it. Okay? So, that's it for this slide, guys. Thanks for watching. It. See you in my subsequent video. Yeah.